Coming up on this, our 24th episode of NSFW, it is high courtroom drama. We're joined by Jolly Roger Chang from Techzilla and HD Nation fame, also East Meets West, right here on the Twit Network. And we make an offer never again to be repeated. Coming up right now on NSFW. Netcasts you love. From people you trust. This is Twit. Bandwidth for NSFW is brought to you by CashFly at C A C H E F L Y dot com. This is NSFW episode 24 for May 18th, 2010. Lulls in order. Troll court. This episode of NSFW brought to you by Audible.com. To download a free audiobook of your choice, go to audiblepodcast.com slash NSFW. No rip off. Hey, hey. Are you guys fighting amongst yourselves? Parentheses laugh. Jackass! He's mocking me! <laughs> These guys are just so easy to manipulate. Yeah. Uh, I won't be satisfied until I give them a piece of my mind. Do you even know what the word netiquette means? Don't you feel empty inside knowing that you're only important on some pathetic message board? Bastard! How dare you talk to me like that? Yes, I may be important on my own homepage, but I'll have you know that I'm also very important. Oh, man. Ain't nothing more fun than taunting an idiot. Well... I guess I should go in for the final blow. Hmm? You're a real shut-in, aren't you? I think this guy's right about me. It's like he's <laughs> in my room watching my every move. <laughs> and with that, I say it is go time. Oh, my God, back in studio for the first time, for the last time, for the only time that matters. It is NSFW, the new show full of wind, the new sauce for the Webernets. And you see, Justin Robert Young, that's how easy it is for me to say all my syllables properly when I'm not all frazzled and rattled and off in some random hotel in the middle of New York. How are you doing, yes! Mr. Justin Robert you Young? You did it, Bri. See? See what I did there? I set up the show. And just like that, we're off to a rockin' start. First time Woo! back in studio. Oh my God. It has been six weeks since we were back in the Mothership Base Star, right here in the middle of Cylon home turf. But we are joined by someone who I'm sure is half Cylon, none other than Jolly Roger Chang. How are you doing, Roger Chang, sir? I am doing great. Oh my God. You I, And I'm so honored the fact that I'm able to call and I'm pretty sure I tried to describe our bizarre shenanigan, but uh, probably did a terrible job of actually doing it. And it was clear that without having any idea what he would actually be doing on the show, Roger was just like, uh, yeah, I'll be done by eight, right? And I'm like, yes. And he's like, all right, I'll do it. <laughs> just like that. And for that, I thank you, sir. <laughs> by the way, speaking of which, uh, before we get to our main event, Justin, like, we got some house cleaning that we got to do, some announcements. First of all, we got to talk about your bizarre X-Files look, the, this new noir reservoir mm. dog sonic conspiracy the theory bender. No, yeah. They... Yeah. Well, folks, if you're watching the video version, then you're seeing me in a suit with a backdrop that we have made in the uh, the iTrick slash Weird Things HQ here in sunny South Florida. And it is because we are launching our brand new YouTube series, Weird Things TV. Uh, we have a teaser that is going up uh, right after this show. And the series itself starts Tomorrow, I filmed the first episode, which is why uh, I, am, I am dressed in the monkey suit. So please do yourself a favor, youtube.com slash TV. Subscribe right now. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. You will not uh, regret it. Brian, you've seen the, uh, the teaser clip. I did. I saw the teaser clip, and I thought it was very good. Uh, and, and it was nice and short, and it blew my mind. It made me feel a little bit weird. But the chat room only wants one thing, and that's for you to do your best Mr. <laughs> Mr. Agent Smith impression and say, hello, Mr. Anderson. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> Go on. Uh, yeah, Come I don't on. know. Maybe, maybe, maybe later in the show. Intimidate maybe us. once, maybe, maybe once we play us. the, maybe once we play the teaser. Intimidate. Then I'll, then I'll give it. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, maybe, yeah. maybe, maybe. Uh, oh, another housekeeping thing. Uh, the guy behind the bbliveshow.info, the bbpedia, now also at bbpedia.net. It's a Wikipedia about everything that happened on BB Live Show and everything that's happening now on NSFW. If you want to get the latest on our uh, uh, summer movie draft, all that stuff. 
Philip is up there. He has added a forum page. We're calling it the Clubhouse, and that is at bbpedia.net slash forums. Everybody jump in, and then we finally have a clubhouse where we, you guys can all complain loudly about how each episode used to be awesome, but now it sucks. And finally, we can have that. Sucks, sucks, jury sucks, used Brian awesome. sucks. Used the only be best awesome. part of the show is Chang. And of course, uh, and hey, if you want to like see... That, that sounds really nice. <laughs> That sounds exactly like what they would say, too. By the way, there is uh, one other change that we made to the summer movie draft. We added like 30 players from the chat room to the NSFW draft. Everyone who sent in an email to join our uh, fantasy summer movie league is now up at bit.ly slash NSFW show or I'm sorry, NSFW draft. So you can actually yeah. see those. Uh, do you know who's number one? Do you know who's winning right now? Give you a hint. It's uh, not you. Well, I mean, in the entire, uh, including the listeners, no, no, no. I, I don't know who's winning. Who's winning? Pete Fick has over $420 million. Pedro Fictitious. Pedro wow. Fictitious. Because I, I, he nabbed. Impressive. He, because he nabbed, uh, he nabbed uh, Clash of the Titans, which was a bargain at $11. It's made $160 million. So he did well there. All right. Yeah. We, but meanwhile, wait a minute. Wait, Brian, don't, don't skip. Don't skip. I, 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 think we, new, I think we covered what, what really We have matters. a new number one pole sitting champion in the NSFW draft amongst those who originally played, and that is... The song that is going to be played at the end of the summer. <laughs> when I win, as I am currently slated to do, Iron Man 2 is romping. You're pathetic. You're pathetic, sniveling little Robin Hood. Uh, came. Did, 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 oh, did, did, look. Did, 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 I wonder if we change all the characters' names and don't follow along with the mythology of Robin Hood, if we could make money. Uh, okay. Sorry, Ridley Scott, if you ain't making aliens and showing Sigourney Weaver and panties on a spaceship, you're two thumbs down, Charlie Hey, dude, Brown. hold on. Look, my heavy hitters are coming up just around the corner and Inception looks like it's going to make a mint as well. So you just wait, sir. You, mister. We'll see who Number right. one with a bullet. Uh, check it out at bit.ly uh, bit slash NSFW movie draft. Right? Yeah, NSFW, NSFW draft, draft is, is what it is. NSFW draft. Okay, look, can we finally start this thing for real? Can we actually get uh, to the reason that we got the esteemed Roger Chang to sit in? Because yeah. he's, not just, he's not just some guy who's no, here. No, I'm not. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Let, let's go ahead and play play the the, the theme song. Well, wait, let me explain what we're gonna do here. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna take something that we love. We love trolling, and we love um, deciding things specifically. Exactly. Who is court? I, I mean, who who is a troll? So we put together a little thing <laughs> we like to call troll court. Here we go. <laughs> In. <laughs> All right, dude. It is go time for Troll Court, where we are going to decide once and for all whether or not you, sir, are a troll. Now, here's the thing. It's not like we're just going to pick willy-nilly. There's a process here. It is written in the Articles of Confederation of Troll Court that there will be a process. And what is that process, sir, Mr. Justin Robert Young? Well, you know, uh, as always, folks, for these games, you got to follow me and Brian on the Twitter. That is Justin R. Young for me, at Schwood for Brian. And uh, we send out, we ask people to send in their own cases that would be tried by me and Brian. Now, uh, I guess we're going to be, are we switching off on who's I think that's the only thing fair. Defense? Look, look, it's, I think it's pretty clear one of us is the more persuasive person than the other. So, you yeah, know, in fairness, we got a flip flop, right? One of us will be the sure. defense, and the other will be the uh, plaintiff. No, the district attorney, right? Yeah, the, the district DA. attorney. Yeah. The DA is going to try to convict you of being a troll because he's a dirty, dirty bad man. But the defense attorney is somebody everybody loves, and that's why the defense attorney, whichever of us is playing defense, has to say it as what? Oh, I, uh, son of a lawyer. Hello. 
<laughs> that way you'll always know. And, uh, and I guess the DA, we don't care what you do. You can be anything you want for the DA. But most importantly, the decider, the person who's going to declare whether or not you're a troll, he will take everything under consideration, both positive and negative, and eventually give his ruling will, of course, be the honorable Judge Jolly Roger Chang. Does that, does that work yeah. for you, Roger? That's that's fine. I can be I can be the uh, the gavel holder. Your 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 word is law, and there will be no dispute. You hear that, cool. Justin? Here we go. I feel like we should all stand up as as the judge enters the chambers. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I and think all so. All rise, Judge Jolly Roger Chang. All right, here we go. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, presiding Jolly Roger Chang. Everyone, please rise. Do I need to stand up for myself? No, yes, no, yes, you, you have, do. You say, yeah, oh, Brian, right. you don't clap for him. He's not <laughs> yes, a you fan. clap for the judge. That's what you do. <laughs> you don't. show him respect on go. this show. Now he's you, sad, are, so you know, you know what they should there do is go. do the Arsenio Hall. Woo, woo. <laughs> <laughs> that Let be. me get a what? What? Okay, are we ready here? Can we, can we get started? A, you know, Roger's got. He's got a little a little plate on the front of his bench. It says Chang's Court's a funky court. So you got to do the the dog the dog pound kind of thing as he walks in. <laughs> All right, can we start with the first one? What's going to be our first uh, bailiff, who's the only person dressed in a suit here? Can you please tell us what bailiff is the first case? dressed in a suit? What? Uh, uh, They're dressed in a uniform and a suit. So you yeah, yeah, dude, let's look. Uh, you got, yeah, and, and don't question the judge. The judge says you're in a suit, so you got to be the- You're not the judge! You've got to be the, well, but the judge said, and I'm agreeing, you've got to be the bailiff. Now, bailiff, go. All right, all right. Here we go. We are going to start with the uh, let's say the the Vogel case. Brian, do you want to roll with that, or yes. do you want to roll with one before that? This is the case of uh, Vogel v. Ghost, right? Yes, and, yes, and, yes. And, 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 and which 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 case? Uh, you, this whatever it is, we're flip flopping from now on. So you want to be prosecution or defense? Uh, I am going to be defense on this one. I'll start. Okay. I'll start uh, on defense. And uh, you want me to read the email? Yes. Uh, I tell you what. Yeah, you go ahead and read the email, and I'll show it to the folks at home. Uh, your Honor, first of all, uh, Your Honor, as a district attorney, I'd like to bring to you the case of Vogel v. Ghost. And I believe my first piece of evidence will be the following affidavit written by Ghost himself. Justin. A guy operating under the name Ghost is a live politics podcast that he is best described as a blend of rage-fueled conservative talking points and incredibly racist comedy bits. He also makes the mistake of taking calls live, which rarely ends well. I noticed his constant mocking on a nasal, amb ambiguously Jewish voices and deep-seated hatred for Howard Stern and use the knowledge to grab a persistent troll bomb intended to inspire as much anger as possible from a single sentence. He took my call and I delivered. What ensued was a seven-minute on-air meltdown replete with screaming, panting, and even the sound of him breaking various objects in studio out of pure rage, ending with him having to pause the show to take a breather. The full clip in all of its glory is attached to the email. It's obviously a bit long, so skip ahead if you must. Just know that his rage continues to build throughout the tirade, keeping it interesting throughout. And that is the opening statement. Uh, opening statements from the defense. Uh, no, that's just the statement of evidence. That that is the issue of disclosure. So now all the evidence is right, right. there. Right. No, no. Brian, but I'm asking you to give your opening statement for the defense. Oh, oh, for the defense, I will play the tape for which we were given. I, I'm sorry. This this is what the defense wants to do. The defense wants Absolutely. to play the tape. This is it's. Are you House. aware? Yes. yes, sir. Yes, sir. If you can do me a favor and please play Exhibit B, the ghost tape. Anyway, say four six six five two four eight six nine. Let's see if we have any uh, decent callers here. Eight four five. You're on the air. Hi, I'm Ghost. I can break stuff on the air because I'm jealous of Howard Stern. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! Get him off! You see, folks, this is what I'm saying here, folks. If it's not feminists. All right, sitting here complaining that I'm calling them out for the bull-nosed bull dykes that they are. If it's not uh, liberals, uh, you know, trying to agitate me because I'm yanking them right out of the Trotsky communist closet. And if it's not, uh, you know, teabaggers and, you know, all these other people, uh, you know, uh, calling me up because I'm not falling hook, line, and sinker with their propaganda and their team, I've got these god 
Damn, Howard Stern asshole! Uh, 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 your Honor, Your Honor, with your permission, I, I think we've heard quite enough here. Uh, as, as the district attorney on this course, uh, I think it's very clear that somebody called by his own admission with the intention of getting a rise out of somebody and get him angry, giving him a bad day. I think the case is perfectly clear, sir. This man is a troll, and I defy you, Mr. Defense. To explain how he's not a troll. Go. Well, now, Brian, does it surprise me that you would think that my client, Mr. Vogel, is a troll? No. No, sir, it does not. <laughs> because we live in a world where some people are prone, by the grace of God himself, to be trolled. Um, and you cannot compel a man. Do not troll when the trolling target is so juicy. Brian, and I asked the jury himself, as well as the Honorable Judge Chang, do you walk up every morning to your front door and scream at the sun that it has risen? No. No, you do not. This man, if he was not trolled by my client, would have been trolled by somebody else. This is just the way of the world, and I therefore declare that he should be found <laughs> not guilty, sir. Okay, uh, all right, Judge Honorable Chang, uh, I, the, the defense essentially says this guy so clearly had it coming that, that you should let uh, this troll off the hook. Is he a troll, yes or no, Mr. Roger Chang? Um, you know, he didn't really... He, did he get, how, what did he really say? I mean, all he said was he hated Howard Stern, or not, not he hated Howard Stern. He, um, that, was it that he liked Howard Stern? I'm trying to remember. What, no, no, no. Okay, that? first of all, the, the defendant is John Vogel, who is the okay. man who called the radio show attempting to incite a disaster, which he very successfully did, hearing the response from the talk radio show host. I... I would say, if if not in, in exact form, in actual function, yes, he is a troll. So you say, let me get this straight, he is guilty. Let, guilty or no yes. guilty? Guilty. You, 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 you're found guilty of trolling. Here's your troll, troll. <laughs> <laughs> there, there it is. We've got our first guilty verdict from the Honorable Judge Chang, which, by the way, what does that say? Swaggle. <laughs> what does that say about our ability to defend, uh, to, to represent our clients when he didn't even know, like, who the guy on trial was? <laughs> or... <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe, sir, we need to get better at explaining the bits, sir. <laughs> All right, you might bailiff. want to point out who exactly the, uh, the plaintiff and the defendant, or the defendant is. All right, bailiff, what is the next one on the, by, on, on the docket? By the way, I do want to say that my favorite part was the fact that the heading for that particular email was, uh, I trolled a call-in podcast to great results. No, it wasn't BB Live Show. So thank you for that. All right, Justin, who's next? What do you say? Uh, all right. Oh, I've been trying to find the name of the one. Brian, it was the UK one. If you remember who that was. Uh, the UK, meaning... Remember the political one? Uh, oh, yes. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Here, I'll be happy to, I'll be happy to read this. Uh, okay, so this one here comes to us from... Uh, I don't know if they want us... It says, it says anonymous. So uh, I'm going to guess... That, uh, that they don't want their name given. But, uh, uh, <clears throat> uh, Your Honor, allow me to give you the following. Uh, this one begins, where to begin? I pose as a religion nut on places where atheists hang out. I post grossly bigoted opinions on debate forums and then white and then uh, that, and argue that black is white until I'm banned. I participate in 4chan raids on Facebook memorial pages for people who died. Suicides are most fun. I've emptied guild banks on WoW and got the people I stole from banned for insulting me when I did it. I covered my own town in flyers saying, tired of three-party politics? Go to lemonparty.org during the election. <laughs> I'm British. I could go on, but I've rambled enough already. Trolling is an art. <clears throat> uh, well, your honor, your honor, I believe that there are some people who are so clearly misguided, so upside down, left is right, black is white, night is day, that they've lost their grip with reality. And to these people, they believe this is an acceptable form of communication. I maintain my client is insane, sir. District, you're your, your witness, sir. 
Judge Chang, jury out there, not me. <laughs> I submit to you, Exhibit A, Brian, can you please show... Your Honor, I object. Uh, there, is, there is some evidence that is too inflammatory, and I'm afraid we cannot share it with the jury. It will, it will corrupt the very nature no, no, of this no. process. No, no, This needs to be seen. Uh, Judge Chen, can you please overrule this objection? Uh, overrule. Let's see the, uh, let's see the evidence. Because so please, far, sir, all I've, all show I've Exhibit A. Uh, uh, your Honor, uh, this appears to be a poster put up by this alleged troll. <laughs> that it has a lemon. All with right, the words. here we go. Uh, it says it's a lemon. Politics left you bitter? Question mark. And then a stylized strip that says lemonparty.org. Oh well, Do your I honor, what is what is so wrong? Objection. Speaking out of turn. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Do I have to explain what lemonparty.org is? <laughs> that there. Are, are, are good-hearted voters during one of Britain's most impassioned elections in their history that are going to a site where three elder gentlemen are uh, making uh, yo, yo, uh, feel better uh, Mr. District Attorney, stage. I believe this man is a troll for that alone, <laughs> let alone the other horrific acts that he has perpetrated. Throw the book at him, Judge Chang. Uh, Judge, uh, Judge Chang, perhaps you ought to visit lemonparty.org yourself. I just did. <laughs> um. I, wait, hey, hold on. Wait. Had, had the judge never been to lemonparty.org? <laughs> the judge really doesn't go seeking things like lemonparty.org. <laughs> Do not anybody at home go, go to <laughs> lemonparty.org. That was, I can't believe you missed that, Justin. That was so. That was such a perfect opportunity to say that was the only way to settle this. But <clears throat> um, your honor, now that you have seen the evidence, uh, what is your ruling, sir, sire? 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 Yes. Sire? yes. Honor? Yes. Your, your highness? Your, your um, highness? Well, first of all, it's, uh, it's, it's kind of complicated. He, is, he, he does confess to being a, a troll, and he's... Uh, Given given several examples, none of which I've seen except for the lemonparty.org. Um, he is kind of stupid since he uses the word bitter for lemon since it should be a lime. Um, you would be more <laughs> sour with lemon. And seeing that picture, you might be pretty sour too. Um, but uh, I would have to say that... I, you know, it, it's, it's hard to say because... Cause, uh, it, it it feels more like a, a kind of a culture jam thing than an actual troll for 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 an actual elicited reaction because if they were to do something that literally pressed everyone's buttons yes they would be a troll but in this case he was trying to be a smart ass and he wasn't so well, good at but, it. But, 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 the the your honor is speaking and, silence and the judge is speaking judge. sir one final piece of of events that he admits I mean, no, 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 no. Do, do not question the judge. Do not him, question the judge. The judge is speaking. The judge is speaking. The judge is speaking. I say, I said the judge is speaking, sir. He admits sir. to being a troll. This is a guilty plea. It's Dude, open to uh, you, you, sir, will not submit to correct our judge. He is the final arbiter. Additional evidence. I'm just submitting additional evidence. What is it? A complaint? No, I, I, I said it. Okay, well, I, I shouted over it, so nobody heard it. Okay, go on, Roger, you were saying? <laughs> um, so, yeah, I would have to say that he isn't a troll in the classic internet sense, but he is kind of a deviant. He's because a deviant. Because he admits doing 4chan, which, no offense, is a nest of deviants, and uh, he, he did point people to lemonparty.org, which is so grossly... The final Did, ruling, your highness. I would say, I would say, as a troll, no. As a, as as a, as a, as kind of a fetishized pervert, yes. You can't handle the truth be, 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 because you're not a troll. <laughs> That's it. One, two to nothing. Two to oh! nothing. Two yeah, to I nothing. have never got my butt handed to me at an NSFW game. Like I this know. I'm not sure, sir, sir. Well. Perhaps that $20 I gave his highness was a good idea. Next up on the docket, bailiff jury. I don't know why you keep escalating the platitudes <laughs> for the judge. 
<laughs> Lord Imperator well, Chang has well, been well, very supreme good over Lord Chang. Please. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. All right. Next up, what do you want to do next? What's next on the docket, sir? Uh, where well, you pick? You pick the next one. <clears throat> um, I guess I will pick at random. I'm going to go with a good friend of the show, Car Hacks. Car Hacks. I'm not going to give his real name because uh, I don't know if he wants it given or not. Um, but then here we go. <clears throat> Whenever a religious person, this is how I think, I'm pretty sure Swedish people talk this way. <clears throat> Whenever a religious person brings <laughs> up something involving God, Ganesha, or whatever, I pre or whatever, I pretend to be very interested. Then I continue to say, that deity told me himself he does not exist. This usually gives them a puzzled look. The argument usually goes downhill from there because it's very easy to argue when neither person can prove anything. And when they try to disprove, they're actually disproving themselves. Am I a troll? Car hacks. Mr. Defendant? Mr. Defense? I submit to the judge and all watching that everybody's personal belief to a deity is sacred. And for somebody to take that under advisement and with that pure seed of knowledge, decide to bend his plowshare back into a sword and slice into the tender underbelly of what we would consider even a humanity makes this man not only a troll, but a bit of an asshole. <laughs> you, you realize you're supposed to be defending him right now. All that said. <laughs> <laughs> Without a spirited debate in our society, then who are we but simple cavemen dwelling in our in our little hubbles, not wanting to fear into the light, afraid that we will see something that disagrees with this. Not only is this man unnecessary change element of society for which we rely upon, but someone for whom if we discouraged him, we would be not the great nation which we are today, the defense rests. Okay, <laughs> your, your honor, um, uh, the defendant's testimony notwithstanding, uh, there are there is a time and a place for proper discourse between individuals on philosophy and religion and those things. And in those part places of discourse, we have achieved great things Great leaps forward in philosophy. This is not one of those arenas, your highness. Uh, this is an arena where somebody specifically by his own testimony says, whenever a religious person brings up something involving God, Ganesha, or whatever, I pretend to be interested. And uh, objection, say, objection. Prosecution is using my southern accent. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, you're right. Uh, that's, oh, oh, uh, sustained, sustained. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, regardless, the point is, the guy doesn't want to engage in debate. He just wants to piss off. It's clear he wants to piss off the person, and he uses religion to do it. This guy has the stated intention of making people angry so he can enjoy it. I submit that there is not a clearer definition of a troll. Your overlord. Well, all right. So was he solicited for an opinion? In other words... Did he, was he standing there in the, the said person who believed in Ganesh or God? Or that whatever? is unclear. Uh, yeah, That's, it says whenever a religious person brings up something involving God. So it sounds like he was not asked for his opinion. It is unclear by the text. <laughs> I think it's, Be it's very, very uh, clear. The, the, reason, the, the reason it's, it's, it's very important. <laughs> one, of the, one, of the, one, one of the key points or, or one, one of the key facets of, of any troll is to be in a conversation and whether they're not wanted. In other words, they insert themselves into the conversation uh, regardless of whether, they're, whether or not they were invited. So if he was, in fact, not solicited for that conversation, say he was at the bus stop and he heard two old guys talking, and he just kind of went in and just started talking, yeah, he'd be a troll. However, if he was actively uh, um, engaged in the conversation, say like a, a Jehovah's Witness came up to him and, and started talking, no, he would not be a troll. Well, it says here, whenever a religious person brings up something involving God. 
So. That this is, I believe, sir, that this refers to any conversation he has with somebody. Uh, of the uh, 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 objection, objection, putting words in the mouth. It is unclear. It is unclear, sir. I do declare that at the very least you can say that it is not beyond the reason of a shadow uh, of doubt that this man <laughs> is injecting his opinion unwantedly. <laughs> Wait, you're defending him or not? <laughs> yeah, dude. Uh, you, you, you did it again. You. <laughs> no, 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 no. He's in a conversation with these people. He is in a conversation. <laughs> Your Honor, I'm afraid I'm going to have to move for a ruling here. I would have to say he's not a troll. You can't handle the truth. Be, 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 because you're not a troll. Oh, my God. Three to yes. nothing. Oh, no, wait, no, no. you he, say he's he, not a troll? Oh, two yeah. to one. Damn. Yeah. Oh, on it. the board, bitch. Dang Woo. it. <laughs> Dang it. You, did get, you did get a good defense. I can't believe he's not a troll. He's clearly saying it just to he, tick people if, off. If he was engaged, I, it, you know, you can, you can, yeah, if, if he was engaged actively and you didn't want to be in it and you just <laughs> you weren't agreeing with it. That's not being a troll. If you were, if you were just walking by and you just surreptitiously inserted yourself into other people's conversations, dropping crap left and right, yeah, you'd be a dick and a troll. Okay. Well, by the way, chat room says, uh, <laughs> chat room says, wow, and jury was arguing the other way, eighty-eight percent of the time. So that's saying something that your ability <laughs> to go against. No, I do not <laughs> pretend to think that other people who are, do not have the kind of legal training like I have can understand my strategy. Um, okay, this is interesting. I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know what to say about this one. This is one from uh, from. I guess I won't say who. No, 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 I got, I got one. I got oh, you one. got one figured out? All right, go for yeah, it. Yeah, go yeah. for it. Go for it. This, this all you. one is from. Uh, oh yeah, but I think the way we should do it is we'll each pick one and we'll be the prosecution. Okay. Or, no, or, or we'll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. no, that's we'll, good. Okay, all right, all right. You will prosecute. Well, you just control. defended to success. So, yeah, you yeah. can prosecute so, this one. So, here we go. Uh, this one is from. Uh, uh, I mean, he doesn't put a, say that he wants another name. So, it's a Tad O'Connor who, uh, who writes Me and my friend regularly partake in what we like to call pedo fishing. We go to omegle.com and pose as a 14 year old girl. Then you ask them to go on Skype. Then do the magic of cam tools. We play the video of a chick. Then we coerce him into pleasuring himself. We wait until he gets into it and then switch off the video uh, to us making small penis gestures. The question I pose is, are we internet superheroes or just plain trolls? And I might say of all the cases that we received, this was among the most uh, uh, divisive. Would that, would that be an agreement, Brian? Yeah, yes, is, uh, I would. Would you like to open with your prosecution, sir? Oh, uh, no, no, no. The, 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 the defense can go first. All right, your honor. Yeah, oh, yeah, thank you. You're giving it to me like an honor. Like, I get to go first. Like, you're not just going to turn around and put it again. You can, you can hang yourself on this noose first. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> your honor, pedophiles. The case rests. <laughs> Justin? Uh, number one, objection. The defense did not use a southern accent. <clears throat> Your Honor, <laughs> a pedophiles, of the defense rests. Judge Chang, defite, or de despite the uh, defense attorney's rabid fandom of pedophiles, as he stated. <laughs> That's not case, what I was saying. I did not shout pedophiles. Objection, <laughs> talking over the prosecution. I was saying. Objection. Oh, Sustained. <laughs> All right, go. Despite. The rabid fanboy mentality for pedophiles, as stated by the defense attorney. I submit that despite the noble intentions of this young man and the worthy target for which he skewers, this is using the mantle of trolldom as it has rarely been seen. It is pure trolling from the miss, uh, the, 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 the cloaking of his identity to the painful reveal for which he destroys somebody's self-esteem. No matter how pitiful the target, this is trolling and he should be sentenced as one. Your Honor, was it trolling when the rebels destroyed the Death Star? Was it trolling when Objection, you made your <laughs> argument. You made your argument. You made a one word argument and you need to live with it, Foghorn. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Your your honor. Um 
Yeah, I would have to say so. What? You have He's a troll. He is a troll? Yes. No! <laughs> You're found guilty of trolling. Here's your troll, troll. Oh, my God. I can't believe you just came out in support of pedophiles everywhere, Your Honor. No, that was you know, were the one you know in what? support of pedophiles. You know what? Uh, the the uh, the pr the prosecution put up a, a pretty good uh, case, and uh, the defense really didn't put up much of any. So. Oh, dude, come on! I was trying to be clever. All right, scry, fine. You know what? Maybe I will have to give you <laughs> How a did that one work chance. out? Because it's called good. It's called good television, sir. When you make for a. <laughs> hey, what do you say? Uh, what do you say? Now we have talked about pedophiles. We bring up our new sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Justin. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> <what>? <laughs> Pedophiles! Anyway, uh, here we go, folks. We have uh, a sponsor which is near and dear to all of our hearts. You know it, I know it. It's audible.com. I've said before that uh, eventually we are going to evolve into a species whose eyes fall out at the age of eight, and the only way we will be able to consume books <laughs> is through our ears. Uh, and that is when Audible will not only be king, they will run our government. Get on the train now. It's audible.com, audiobooks like you've never heard them before. Uh, Brian, what, what is the fantastic deal that we have for everybody? Uh, you know what? I actually don't know which one. You can either you can sign up for the platinum or for the uh, for the gold one. And I'm sure in the chat room somebody will send me a private message telling me which one is the one that we're supposed to be doing this week. But I can talk about which Audible book I'm listening to at this very moment. Two weeks ago, I told you I've been on a bit of a Robert A. Heinlein kick. Uh, huge fan. You know what? Let me actually put it up here on the screen here as well. It's audiblepodcast.com slash NSFW. I've been on a Robert A. Heinlein kick. I finished um, <clears throat> uh, one book that was non-ironically referencing space Nazis on the moon. Which uh, was a bit of a surprise for me. I didn't. I didn't see that one coming. I got to be honest. But now I'm on to Citizen of the Galaxy, which is really, really good. It. Uh, I'm only about halfway through it. So if you know how it ends up, don't tell me. Uh, I think I recommended um, uh, Variable Star last time. It was a book that was written by Robert A. Heinlein in sketch form. You know, just sort of some some highlights and notes, and was finished uh, years after his death. It was an amazing book. Citizen of the Galaxy is turning out to be pretty good as well. You can't go wrong with classic science fiction. And I don't think I've shared with you my secret, Justin. What I like to do, <clears throat> what I like to do is I like to find any Hugo or Nebula award winner. You look for the ones that won the science fiction awards and you know you're gonna do well. That's how I first came Rarely across. gonna go well or uh, go poorly on that one, right? Yeah, that's rare. Yeah, uh, that's how I discovered the, 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 the Red Mars, Green Mars and Blue Mars uh, series, the Mars trilogy as well. Are you are you reading any Audible books on uh, podcast form, Audible? Audible? Judge uh, I am. Well, I was going to get uh, um, the girl with the dragon tattoo because I watched the movie a couple of weekends ago. And uh, I was really interested because uh, I was talking to someone who actually did read it. And we we're kind of discussing the the changes and the similarities and things that they kept. So and, and it is part of a, a trilogy, the Millennium Trilogy. So as soon as I get an Audible account, I will download those books. Oh, my goodness. What about you, Justin? What are you doing? Uh, I'll tell you, I'm going to uh, plug a book that I have not read yet, but I know is very, very good, and I know that I will enjoy because I enjoy the author, and that is uh, Ben Mesrick's The Accidental Billionaires. I think that we uh, plugged it on here before because Brian's read it and really, really dug it, but I love Mesrick as a writer and with all the Facebook stuff in the news now that there could rarely be a person in, in tech culture who you'd want to get more of a backstory on than Mark Zuckerberg. Uh, and, and I'll tell you what. There is, if you've not read Bringing Down the House, which was the movie that 21, the horrendous movie was based on, uh, Mesrick is a kind of writer who gets to the core of uh, a lot of just awesome, awesome, nitty gritty human social issues uh, for which, I mean, if you've not, Bringing Down the House is great on, on Audible and I have listened to that on Audible, but uh, it, it, it's, he's, he's a great writer. I'm so excited to read it. Or listen to it. Because reading is for morons. That's Audible's, <laughs> uh, that's Audible's slogan. Reading is for stupid, slack not, jobs, that is not moron their, idiots. That is not their slogan. Don't, that is not their slogan. Don't be a stupid moron. Th that's Listen not, to your books through your ear holes. That's not their Audible. thing. That's, that's not the thing. 
Okay, so here's the thing. Yeah. Not, only, not only when you sign up will you get a free audio book, uh, any of our picks, but here's the other thing is you'll be keeping our show in business, but most importantly, we are not above bribery here on NSFW. That's why nope. we love you more than any other show on all of the internet. Nobody else says I will personally slip you a $5 bill if you head on over to my sponsor's website. We're those guys. And in fact, I'll be happy to send you a copy of my book, Cheats, Cons, Swindles, and Tricks, 57 Ways to Scam a Free Drink. All you have to do is when you sign up at audiblepodcast.com slash NSFW, then uh, take a screen grab of you signing up, and I will send that to you uh, on my own dime over to you. And so far, uh, we finally actually just got home. So yesterday, we sent out like 35 books. A bunch of people have signed up uh, and took advantage of the free book offer. So now that's two free books. You get a free book for signing up. And you get a free book. You get my book. You get to take money out of my own pocket because I love you so much. What are you doing for the cause, Justin? What are you going to do? I'll tell you what. If you sign up to Audible right now or any time before the next time that we do an Audible ad and you email it into NSFWshow.com, I'm going to call your phone and I'm going to scream some really nice things about you. <laughs> I'm going to personally give you a phone call and I'm going to yell about how great you are until you hang up on it. <laughs> oh my God, you realize that our fans will absolutely take you up on that. Without Sign hesitation. up for Audible, baby. That's all you got to do. Listen, they have all sorts of plans. They have the gold or the, the silver plan, which is one book a month. They got the, That's gold, the gold plan, plan. which That's is the two gold bucks plan. a month. That's the, the gold plan is one book oh, a month. Oh, the gold plan is, is one platinum book a month. The platinum is two plan bucks a month. is two books a month. Yes, yes. And of course... The uh, Leprechaun Flesh Plan is 7,000 books a month. No more precious metal than the flesh of leprechauns. By the way, what I love is that this is so far below unobtainium. I said beloved. I meant below. <laughs> <laughs> it is beloved more so than unobtainium. But it's 7,000 as opposed to the billion and a half. I know. That's what's confusing, dude. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, so there we go. So, And that's my, that's my, it's only for until the next time that we do an Audible ad. So okay. there's a limited window, but if you do it yes. and you sign up, uh, then then I will call your phone and I'll yell at you. And you know what? Uh, do me a favor. Just promise that you'll record all of those so we can put them together in a montage. You got it. All Let's right. Let's get back to the cases. All right. Back to the cases. But don't forget to send uh, sign up at audiblepodcast.com slash NSFW and send us an email at NSFWshow at gmail.com. Uh, all right, bailiff. What do you got next? No, no, it's your call. Oh, you, you, you get the next, uh, the next case. And I have to prosecute this one. Is that correct? You, you uh, prosecute it. Yeah. I cannot believe. Oh, I'm so disappointed that I wasn't able to. Uh... Hey, listen, I lost the case where the guy admitted to trolling uh, <laughs> memorial pages on Facebook, okay? <laughs> we all have our crosses to bear this week. Uh, okay. Um, you know what? I'm actually like, now it's a contest and I really want to actually win. And so, uh, it's okay, we'll do this. I'm, I'm just going to read this and we'll see if it's good or not. <clears throat> I despise Facebook and I want everyone I know to delete their account. Oh, and I want the Facebook Android app off my phone, but I can't delete it. And I want Dave Salmone from Animal Planet to come to Cincinnati Zoo. Oh, and I constantly want, am I a troll or am I just needy? Uh, or am I wanty? Or am I trolling for attention? Are you, are you reading this? If not, why not? Because if I'm a troll or ask too many questions, have you visited my blog or Googled me yet? Can Jerry speak Danish? Does he listen to Hedge Mathematik? They have a weird song called Party, I, uh, I Provinson. Are you guys going to make fun of me? I hope not because that would suck. Can I be on the show? Is there NSFW merch? How cool is Betty White? I put her on the show. Kevin Attic. Uh, you want to you wanna take us out here, Mr. Defense? Now, Judge Chan, we've seen many trolls this evening, but however, not one has had the audacity to step into your courtroom, sir, and troll this very institution. I believe that this man is not only a troll, but he is spitting in the face of troll justice, and you personally, sir, you need to lock this troll in troll jail and make sure he's troll raped by other fellow troll inmates. <laughs> the defense rests. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, you're defending him? Or are you probably... I don't understand. You're like... You're supposed to be defending him, but you, you just prosecuted him. <laughs> Did you forget that you were defending him again? Furthermore! 
<laughs> Defense is already arrested. Oh, Defense is already arrested. You know, objection, you, sir. You know, objection, 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 objection. Objection. Defense uh, requests a continuum. No, no. Over. A continuum. Your, your, your honor, your honor. You the defense is already arrested. I think we're done here. Defense will request a continuum to continue the argument. <laughs> Defense, sir. <laughs> Mr. Your Honor, I think you say you set it up. If the prosecution may now make their case, sir. Yes, please. Oh, okay. <clears throat> this ought to be fun. <laughs> the prosecution. <laughs> Maybe we should have picked a different accent to do the defense. Because <laughs> clearly all we want to do is prosecute when we speak like a Southern lawyer. Uh, <laughs> Your Honor, I think it's pretty clear this person tried to actually troll us live on the air. As even the defense agrees, uh, we appear to be unanimous. Your Honor, I move for an instant ruling at this moment. Uh, not a troll. Yeah! 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 It's why? Why? You can't why? handle the truth. Be, 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 because you're not a troll. I... In, in spite of the defense's horrible skill at, <laughs> at, at defending their client, and in spite of uh, the, the vague and, and the nondescript charges against him, everything that I've seen, and I, and I, agree, I think we can all uh, speak to this truthfully, is that he basically wrote back to a solicited request from you to send in an email about well, but, trolls. Uh, but he so, clearly, it was attempted trolling. It was attempted again, trolling. my unorthodox <laughs> style comes to the forefront. I'm Actually, he sounds what more, it means to be a defense sounds more attorney. bipolar than anything else. Are We're you telling me friends. that on, <laughs> on a show out of my own studio with rules that I help make up myself, where my opponent is actively working for me, I'm still going to end up losing my own stupid <laughs> game on this stupid show. Is that really where I'm headed here? All right. All right. Next one. You got uh, it. All right. Here we go. I am uh, calling up the case of Trent Ryan. Right. Hey, guys. I was watching a video on Makinama Respawn, the YouTube channel, and I noticed the most recent comment was spam. It read, hey, guys, go check out my channel for some awesome commentaries. And commentaries is misspelled. I reply to him with a nice acronym, GTFO. About a minute later, he gets back to my replies uh, and comments that I'm a troll. So I ask the gods of the interwebs, am I a troll? He is uh, right now watching in the chat room. Now, just this, to be this, clear, this is I uh, am the prosecution, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, first of all, real quick, which, which, uh, which, who is this again? Trent Ryan. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. So wait, so I I need to. So the evidence is on the message or uh, in the chat room right now. Yeah, yeah. No, most of these guys were in the chat rooms right now. No, no, oh, I know, no. The the, 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 uh, the accused the is the, in the, the chat accused. Room. Yes, yes. So, so uh, in other words, all the evidence that can either indict him or, or or clear him is in the chat room. So I need to watch the chat room. Well, no, uh, no, 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 no. <clears throat> No, no, no. Like, like he's saying he currently is in the chat room. Uh, his testimony has just been given. Uh, are you ready for for defense? May I defense, sir? Uh, please. Uh, the, the the defense may make their opening. Statement. Wait, no, no, no. I'm prosecuting. No, you're prosecuting. Who's I'm prosecuting? prosecuting. You're, de you're, you're defending. You're prosecuting. Got it. Okay. You're defending. <clears throat> uh, your honor. Your honor. <clears throat> your honor. <laughs> Wait, is it is it trolling to defend one's children from mad? pedophile racists who attempt to destroy your life? Is it trolling to defend against aggression from an armed combatant who wishes to do harm to you? Well, this is a man who's clearly only responding out of defense. A troll initiates violence. He initiates the hatred. This is a guy who initiated spam upon this poor man. And what did he say? He did not talk about his race, his gender, his age. He said simply, get your, get yourself be gone, <laughs> is what GTFO means. Get yourself be gone, he said. And I think that was a fine, fine response. Your witness. Hmm. Judge Chang, imagine you're but a simple young boy enjoying the fruits of YouTube. You find a channel that you really gosh darn like. So much so that you want to make commentaries about that about that product, man. I'll tell you what, you like it. You like it so much. 
and you work so hard, you know, you stay up all night, your mom is telling you to go to sleep, but you really, really, really want to add something to the community. And once you're done and you put something up, you right there in that, uh, in that comment thread, hey folks, why don't you go check out the fruits of my labor? And then all of a sudden, a snarl to troll. Objection. Objection down your the hill. Objection on the language. Objection on the defense of spam. I clearly, I proclaim you to, to be a spam Overruled artist. It. A spam it. artist. He's afraid that a his case is falling apart. in this very court. I, no, judge, sir. overruled I, or sustained? Uh, sustained. Spam artist, go. The prosecution's unclear how he can continue if you just sustain the challenge against my entire argument. <laughs> yeah. All right. Admit you're uh, a spam artist. Admit you're a spam artist right now. He is not. He is, he is, he is trying to have like-minded people see the work that he's worked so hard on, and he's snapped at by somebody older and bigger than him. It's he's a, This person is a bully. He's a troll. He's picking on the weakest of our YouTube society, and he should be punished as one. <laughs> Your Honor, I think uh, we. I would say not a troll. Uh, wait. So you say not a troll? Not you a can't troll. handle the truth be, 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 because you're not a troll. Oh my God! Does that mean we're actually tied? Does that mean tied. we're tied? That See, means we have your, one more. There's your dramatic. Dramatic cliffhanger. Right Thank you, Your Honor. All right, Mr. Robert Jungles, the you, second. You get, you get last uh, case pick. Uh, no, I, oh, no, wait, I defended. Oh, shoot. So I have to prosecute this last one? Yep. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Prosecution's <laughs> tough. Uh, <clears throat> um. <laughs> By the way, I really want to get the soundboard club. Oh, man. Prosecution's tough. <laughs> That is how I feel. Um, okay. <laughs> Cobalt Tiger in the chat room. Oh, man. Math is hard. Uh, I, I think we're out. Are we out? No, 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 no. I think There's we're, a, I think we're uh, out. Mr. Kane. The Kane case. The Kane case? Ah, oh, this is not a case. Uh, okay, fine. Wait, I don't understand. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna well, no, no, no. Wait, wait. I, 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 okay, no, I mean, yeah, yeah. or no, we can oh. do the, the Davin case. Oh, yeah, no, 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 uh, yes, I was excited about that one. Where, where is the Davin? Or no, no, no the, the Bell case. Oh, no, never mind, never mind, no, no, no. Wait, where is, where is the one that, that the ones I want? Um, uh, the Valentine case is still out yes, there. Yes, that's the one, but I don't understand any of it. Can can you explain I can, it? I can explain okay, it. Okay, yeah, okay, all right, all right, yeah, go for it. Uh, for those of you who are not sports inclined, there was a defensive rookie of the year in the National Football League who failed steroid tests. And the uh, Associated Press, who gives out the award for rookie of the year, decided to uh, take a revote to try and take his award away because they now felt he didn't deserve it. So there was this big brouhaha last week. And in the middle of all of that, so TSS this Hollick, who is a regular uh, viewer here of NSFW, decides to have a Twitter interaction with a NFL player who plays for the Tennessee Titans, not uh, on the Houston Texans, where the uh, guy who had the whole drug issue plays on. Wait, but wait, here uh, was... Uh, set set here, that up one more time for me. Uh, he's having a chat with the guy who's not the one who... No, 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 the, no. But he's just drugs. another NFL player who is, has nothing to do with his time since this is the offseason. So he decides to engage a random hooligan on the internet. Right. Okay. Got it. Got it. Okay. And, and so, uh, 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 the person is St uh, Stephen Tullock of the Tennessee Titans. And, uh, Oh wait, hold on. Yeah. Why don't you, why don't you read it? Continue. Go ahead. Yeah. Okay. 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 So, uh, Stephen Tullock decides to talk smack with another player on the Houston Texans and says, that's right. That's how this you is over Twitter, by the way, this is happening this is over, over Twitter. Twitter. Yeah. This is uh, from uh, Stephen Tullock to Zach Dials on the Houston Texans. Tullock says, this is how y'all do in Houston, huh? Steroids. I knew something was up and y'all had your first winning season. That didn't just sound right. And then the defendant says uh, to him. So the, so the defendant defends Zach Dials by saying, noted, see you in week 12 and 15. Now, who are you again? Tullock says, 
Uh, who am I? Look up Google. That's a good source. Our defendant says, okay. Seven Tullock said, or then, then uh, he also said, no, no, okay, no, no, no. I think we've heard quite enough, sir. I think we've heard quite enough. Uh, what we have is a case where somebody has reached a certain level of stature, of independence. He's a pillar of the community, a sports figure, the likes. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. I'm talking in the Southern accent. Uh, yeah, sorry, wait, wait. objection, Your Honor. Who's prosecution I'm sorry, I'm sorry. my accent. We've got somebody. Who who's reached a pillar of his <laughs> you community? You have to make it white as possible. I know, right? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> What's funny is like we already said Southern lawyer, and it's like that's like the plantation owner voice we've been doing, and so you say even whiter than that. So whiter than, than the Southern plantation owner. Uh, the uh, this is a guy who's a pillar of his community. He's a sports figure. He's having a private conversation. Yes, it's a crowded room. Yes, it's Twitter. But he's talking to someone else, and somebody clearly trying to get a reaction out of him, trying to initiate something to get a rise out of him, says, oh yeah, and who, who are you again? There is no reason he said that other than to get a reaction. And I submit that there's no clear definition of trolling than that action right there, your witness, sir. But you're the prosecution, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. That moment when he said, and who are you again? He was trying to get a rise out of the sports star. And and it worked. Judge Judge Chang, no, uh, do can a I good please defense submit to you? You might win this. Pardon? Do a good defense and you might win this. I'm, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to defend this man to my last very fiber. Uh, sir, uh, Judge Chang, can you please I submit Exhibit C. Uh, Brian, if you can please show the third picture. Uh, <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> the third, uh, your, your, your Honor, uh, the, the, the Exhibit C right here. Here you go, sir. Does that, Your Honor, look like the face of a troll? A man <laughs> who's bringing smiles to Leo Laporte's face. Can I please submit uh, Exhibit B, Brian? Scroll uh, up. Uh, yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. How about look at that smile, the pearly whites on Tom Merry? Objection, I objection, say, objection. I say so. Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> go, go, uh, go ahead. <laughs> I say this man was only trying to engage on a human level. Uh, with uh, objection, the football objection, Your Honor. Objection, he watches objection, every objection, like a objection. God fearing American. Exhibit, exhibit A, exhibit A. We heard exhibit C and exhibit B. I submit that you, Your Honor, I'd like to show you exhibit A. May I, Your Honor? Yes, please. Exhibit A. This same man who was alleged oh. to have made happy one Tomas Marit and one happy Leo Laporte oh, is also a man whoa, who whoa, scares. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The only black man in the set of photos whoa, whoa, given whoa, to whoa, us, whoa. Owen J.J. Stone, a.k.a. Doctor, clearly terrified for his life. Listen, listen, Judge, just because my client enjoys the company of black people so I, much that he would like to take a picture and the prosecution is so terrified that he would not be within five feet, does not make this man guilty of trolling. Your no, Honor, sir. objection. It makes him objection. a bridge builder and a know. friend to the nation as he was a friend to Mr. Tullock on Twitter. He was trying to engage in some lighthearted banter. To call it trolling is overblown and scandalous, sir. Your he Honor. He's innocent. Your Honor, allow me to say that uh, just the race card has been played. All right? It's, it's to you, sir. So, I... Uh, I'm really unclear on how Odakta <laughs> <laughs> pertains to this case. Um, are you saying it's because he's next to him that that somehow his... Uh, his as, as the prosecution. I, prosecution I, decided I don't know, I'm because saying, up the Odakta picture. I'm saying, I'm saying that, uh, look, uh, the race card has been played. That's all I'm saying. And who played it, might I ask? You did, by refusing... Oh! By refusing really now, sir, because I do believe if we were to go back in the transcription that you would clearly see that the man who brought up the photo in the first place was the prosecution. You were the one who refused to show. You were ashamed of this photo. You brought up both of the other photos, and you would not bring up the one with our friend, Owen J.J. Stone, oh, doctor. I submit, Your Honor, that there's two cases of trolling. First, T.S.S. Olick, who's clearly guilty of trying to get a right out of a sports figure, and second of all, the defense itself, who's trying to get a rise out of the American white supremacist movement. 
What is this? For which you are a card carrying member, sir. <laughs> all right. It's got um, to you, Your right, Honor. So I, I will rule this. The, 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 the last piece of evidence uh, has absolutely nothing to do with the case at hand. <laughs> Whether or not the defense is or is not a troll is uh, immaterial since we are focusing on the defendant. Uh, the defendant has merely given his reaction, as anyone would, in a in a in a tweet, um, that that person's like, "Who are you now? Who are you in the sense of who are you to say that, or who are you as? I really don't know who you are." Um, without That's further without further uh, information, <laughs> I cannot deduce adequately uh, that person's intent. Now, do you? Does the prosecution have any additional pieces of evidence uh, they would like to submit to? Uh, uh, your, 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 your Honor, the prosecution would like to turn your attention back again to the actual uh, nature of the exchange. This was not a uh, aimless. Whoa, whoa, meeting. whoa, whoa! Objection! The judge well, well, clearly I, asked for additional evidence, and this is rehashing old evidence. Uh, if I may, objection! If I may be allowed to continue. Yes, prosecution may. Uh, yeah, your, your honor, <laughs> the prosecution would like to point out that this happened on Twitter, an environment by its very nature where only you can follow people who you are following, and thus it is implied you already know who could, they are, sir. Could you bring back the uh, Twitter transcript? Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Clearly, it is addressed to Stephen Talk. Right there. Right there, in blue and white, sir. What would, would the judge please also note the good-hearted back and forth between two people who share a similar interest in following the National Football League? Uh, that's that's mm. for your that's for your highness to. This decide. is this is a very specialized community for which ball busting is not only a staple. Da, 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 but you had your time, defense, Mister Mister Defense Lawyer. You had your time. Ah. Uh, I'm just saying. <laughs> bring, back the, bring back the transcription. Just let me read it all the way through real quick. Sure. <clears throat> all right. So uh, Tulloch says uh, that's, that's how you all do in Houston, huh? Steroids. I knew something was up. You all had your first winning season. Just didn't sound right. Me. Injecting fed, himself into the conversation, Your Honor. Noted. See you in 12 and 15. Now, who are you again? And Tulloch responds. Noted. See you. Uh, you get, haha, look me up in Google is a good source. Okay. Also nice to see that they took... Oh, hey, go, I'm sorry, sorry. Go ahead, go ahead, oh, go yeah, ahead, go yeah, ahead. Oh, please, sir. Can you finish yep. uh, the, the end also, of the transcript? Also, so nice to see you took that in good spirits end of conversation. I, I don't know. It, it didn't seem to be entirely mean-spirited. There was a... Uh, that there is some tension there at, at a point, but it's not necessarily carried through. Now... <laughs> I would have to say he has a troll. Wait, wait, wait he's, he's, I'm sorry, uh, guilty or not guilty? Guilty of trolling. Uh, troll, troll. You, 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 you're found guilty of trolling. It, it's so much that he actively went out of his way to... Uh, oh, yes, yes. For the first time, ladies and gentlemen, a game that Brian Brushwood has won on NSFW. <laughs> How's it taste, Mr. Chester Robert Young? This whole court is out of order. <laughs> Every right. time you talk like that, I want, I want chicken. <laughs> you want chicken? See, there's that's the racism well, that's here. That's a little it's, it's yeah, I was about to say, dude. It's incredibly provincial of me to say that, but really. <laughs> All right, look, I'd say it's time to wrap things up. Uh, thank you so much for joining us, Mr. Robert Chang from uh, from. Uh, by the way, you know that we call you we call you Robert because Justin screwed up your name once upon a time, right? Yes, and it's it's been with me ever since. Okay, good, good. Uh, Mr. Roger Chang from Techzilla, Jolly Roger on Twitter. Anything else you'd like to plug, sir? Uh, check out uh, my podcast with Tom Merritt at uh, Sub. Brilliant.com slash EMW East Meets West and check out HD Nation, Revision3.com slash HD Nation. Right on, Mr. Justin Robert Young. You got something you want to bring up here before we Weird wrap things, things up? TV starts uh, this week. Please go to YouTube.com slash Weird Things TV and subscribe, 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 subscribe. 
Oh, by the way, uh, one quick thing we want to bring up is that we are looking for a summer internship. There are certain jobs that our inimitable producer, uh, Travis Lopes, is not able to handle. And, uh, and of course, Chad, OMG Chad's out there supposed to be making me them dollars. So if you want to give us a hand in booking guests and helping us run the, the email, etc., then give us a call uh, at nsfwshow at gmail.com where you can also send in screen grabs in order to get your free book and take advantage of yours truly. Um, and, of course, I am at Schwood on Twitter, as always. Let me to get some more Twitter followers. The judge is clearly taking a phone call <laughs> while we're yes. talking about that. This fine. Okay, this fine. Okay, no, don't, don't worry about it. Everything's fine here. Yeah. There we go. Justin R. Young on Twitter. Weird Things Com on Twitter. And again, subscribe. YouTube.com slash Weird Things TV. All right. See you next Tuesday. All right. Dying of fire. Fire to fire. Fire to fire. The penalty is eight. Find out. <laughs>